Hi there. So last night I finished all of the hexagons into strips, strips sewn together until the final sort of centerpiece of the top of the fundraising quilt uh, was done. And I just kind of wanted to share with you guys what that came out like. Still got a little bit of work to do. I need to cut out the border fabric and sew the borders on. I need to trim the edges off of this so it's rectangular as opposed to having jagged little edges, which you'll see in a second here. Um, but yeah, we're pretty much done. The, the hard part is done. I just need to sew about 12 straight lines, cut out some fabric, and create the three layers and send it off to the long armor. So here's what it looks like. Let's step back a little bit. Bring it up a little higher. Um, I actually, every time I would see this from across the living room, I liked it more. Patterns really, the overall picture got clearer from a distance. But as you come in up close, you can see the different hexagons that got created. Mm -hmm. Very center of the quilt there. Um, just kind of showing you what some of the overall patterns ended up looking like. Um, I'm happy with it, how it came out. I definitely learned a lesson with this quilt about um, the, the fabric that this was made from I thought was going to translate into very strong colors, but uh, sort of the, the white and black lineage of many of these end pieces ends up translating differently when you read it from a distance. Anyway, each one of these quilts I do has been a learning lesson. Learning lesson, anyway. A lesson, and this one was no different, but I'm pretty pleased with how it's turned out.